Okay, so I have the winner right here. It's Stephanie uh, Jacqueline, and I just wanted to announce it on here because I know there has been someone just like commenting saying they're me and like you've won this giveaway. So don't ever, you know, respond to those. Don't click on any links and I'll always mention it in my video and it will be in my description. And I also contact the winner always. So I just wanted to mention that. Also, I thought I would mention while I sit, there we go. I am getting over a little cold that I've had and before I obviously get comments, I know anyone talking about being sick now online, I saw like, what's her name i love sarah e and uh she was saying how she was sick and like she was getting so many messages about like how she has covid and stuff not everyone when they have a cold or you know they're sick especially in december like i just came back from miami which was like plus 25 and now i'm in like minus 25 weather so just from like the switch of uh weather also can get you sick um but for those of you, I just like mentioning it because I've already taken COVID tests and I took one when I got back as well. And no, I don't have it. Um, it's just a cold. And surprisingly, the girls in Ryan have an immune system of gold, I tell you, because, okay, Ryan, I don't know about your husbands, but Ryan never gets sick. Like, I swear, swear, he like, I've maybe seen him sick twice in the nine years we've been together. It's crazy. I'm like, but he always says it's like how healthy he eats and like he eats so healthy um, and like protein and everything like that. So it's probably, it's probably true because I feel like I didn't eat very good too when I was in Miami. We were just like on such busy schedules and that can definitely do it to your immune system. But I also think the shock of just like going from such hot weather to cold weather um, did it in for me. And two of my other friends are like sick right now too, but Anyways, I thought today would be the perfect day since, um, yeah, I thought I could just do de or declutter my makeup vanity. Also, I have a giveaway in today's video. Now, I, met, or I put in my title in my last video giveaway. I don't think I'm going to do that for this one just because there's so many people that are just pretending to be me commenting and like messaging people that they've won. Please don't click on anything. I know a lot of you guys already know not to do that. And um, like if you see a weird username where it's like WhatsApp, SL Miss Glam, like clearly that's not me. Um, but I always mention it in my video. So always stay tuned for my next Next video when I announce the winner I don't like message you in the comments um, until the next video not on the same video I just wanted to mention that um, so for today's giveaway since I'm gonna try to do it in every video before Christmas I wanted to do a cash giveaway I asked you guys on my Instagram what you wanted most and a lot of you guys just said cash because you want to choose something out and also a lot of people have lost their jobs due to COVID um, within this last year and could use some extra money so I did read all of those and that was like the number one choice so I'm gonna do that in today's video for you guys so I am gonna do a cash $400 giveaway um, so if you guys Guys want to enter all you have to do is comment down below uh, what you like most about my channel also make sure you're subscribed give this video a thumbs up and that is all you guys have to do to enter I don't make mine super complicated um, I just you know they really are just to give back to you and show you guys that I love you and the support that you give me is just um, amazing and I love you guys for that so cash giveaway really excited $400 um, yeah anyways so won't make this intro super long. Let's get into decluttering. But first, I wanted to show you guys how beautiful it is outside. I know, so stunning. I can't get over it. I do love the snow. I think it's so magical to look at. Let's see if I can zoom in. No, or will it let me? Yeah, there we go. Beautiful, so beautiful. Okay, so I think I'll do a little music overlay and then also talk a little bit, a little bit of both in today's video. And um, I apologize that I look tired. Sorry, what I was saying is that it's been a week of no makeup. So I definitely want to just play around, organize, clean, declutter with you guys. I still haven't unpacked my makeup case yet. I'm gonna take out all the brushes because we can clean those. Let me know if you guys have been watching anyone's vlogmas this year. I honestly, I, I haven't been watching anybody's. I think I watched one episode of Alicia Marie's just because like I've watched hers for years now. Um, but other than that, like I haven't watched any. These are all dirty, so let's move them over here. Uh, oh, okay. 
more brushes in here. This was just like the little makeup case that I brought with me. I Oh my gosh, I fell in love with this lipstick. I, I don't know if it's limited edition. It's Pat McGrath, which is the foundation I use as well. Um, and the color Nude Venus. So pretty. Also been going in with this little Sephora lip balm, which I really like. Uh, I need to get another powder because I'm all out. Let me know if there's another powder that you guys like, maybe a more affordable one, a drugstore. Let me know what you use for powder in the comments as well. I've been looking for a new one. And me and both the other girls that I had on the trip, we all just used this powder because they forgot theirs as well. So um, yeah, it was pretty funny. Oh, earring. Okay. These ones are two. I use this one as well. The Burt's Bees is so good. Little Givenchy lip gloss. These are so cute. I think I got it from like the little Sephora points thing. Um, got my eyeshadows right here, which I was using so much. These two shades right here, Takes Two, and then also the Twinkle. goods right here you guys so I thought I would do this first just to show you so Swirl and Sparkle um, is my friend Mary I saw her when I went to Miami and she makes beautiful really custom um, all natural brush cleaners right here also sanitizer which is awesome um, so we have the little mini ones right here which are so cute great for travel you guys know I love anything mini and these ones have the girls names on them this so this says Sophia let's open it up look at that so there's an s on there and I can't wait these are so easy to use as well and they smell delicious that one smells like marshmallow and she said that I think she has new um, scents as well uh, so these are the lar larger ones so yeah they're all all natural cruelty free um, so this is the larger one I love the gold tin Ooh, look at that and she puts like really pretty crystals in the middle and then it's also easier to brush or clean your brushes um and then you get a little bit more grip look how pretty that is beautiful stone so i think i'm gonna go in with the large one today oh and that's her this is her right here so it's always nice to support small businesses and i'm just really excited because obviously with my brushes i get asked every day how do you clean your brushes? So I feel like this would be the perfect collaboration. So we are working on something which I'm really excited about. Uh, and we'll tell you guys more in the future once we start doing that. But these are just so fun. I love them. Okay, let's get some brushes. Bring it over here. Go to my sink. Another little tip, you guys, and I know we were telling a lot of uh, people this when we did the Ipsy event, uh, but don't wet the ferrule. All you guys have to do is wet the bristles, just wet the hair because then, you know, it, it gives it more of a chance for the glue to rub off and for your brushes to not last as long. So I really highly recommend just doing the hair, which is all you're cleaning, right? So this is honestly how I do it, just wet. Wet the bristles, grab the product right here, and we're gonna swirl. And I mean, what an amazing name, Swirl and Sparkle, right? I think she also has another page, which I'll link it down below. Um, I think it's House of Sparkle, but I'll have, to, I'll have to look on that. So I usually do that, and then I just grab my hand, and I also, just for some extra swirling, just like that. Wow, look at that. Like you can already see how much product's coming off. Look at that. My friend actually, um, one of the moms that I brought to Miami, she just used hers the other day and she's like, I have to message Mary and tell her how good this product is. And honestly, I have never, I told Mary, like I've never found a brush cleaner that has worked as well as hers ever. Um, and I mean, they smell amazing. And anytime, 
I don't know, I use like a Sephora brush cleaner. Like my brushes ju just don't smell as good. This makes my brushes smell so nice and you can see all the product is coming out. Sometimes when you use other brush cleaners, I feel like you don't get all the product out and it stains the, the bristle hairs. So, I mean, I just wanted to show you guys this. You can see here. And I mean, these brushes, <laughs> I've used them so much and I have not washed my brushes in a while, so. That's why I'm doing it a few times, but typically you just have to do it like once or twice. Okay, so we are all done right here. You can see this is clean. So what I do is I just dry them on like a, a towel or like a little, you know, hand towel or something like that. There are like those drying racks, which you can buy to have them like this, but I, you know, a towel is fine too. Um, so yeah, look how clean that is. Squeaky clean. And let me know if you want me to do more videos of like brush cleaning because I feel like I get asked this all the time and they're not in enough of my videos. Um, but I feel like, yeah, moving forward, I'm going to start doing that a lot more because obviously it's really important to know how to clean your brushes and to keep them looking, um, you know, beautiful and I think it's just really nice to have those little tips of just like not wetting the ferrule and handle. I've seen people literally like put the entire brush under the water, which just doesn't help your brushes, right? So... Just the bristles. You can see how clean that is. So I couldn't find a box, but I'm just using one of my old bags. So this is going to be like the giveaway bag. Um, and usually I just give, like if I've used makeup like to friends or family, my mom will take like any of my makeup basically. But um, I am gonna start over here. And yeah, the girls can reach into all my makeup drawers. That's why nothing is in the right places anymore. We have, it's pretty organized. This is like all highlighters and blushes. And then I have just some like products that I would reach for regularly and under jaw. Yeah, like I don't even use any of this anymore to be honest and I have so much makeup that I just got too that's in my office that I bought from Sephora um, okay let's start I'm trying to do this at a good angle so you guys can see but we have some face masks here which I don't really use I've been just using this Kiehl's one let me show you This one right here, this is like my go-to mask right now, so I don't think I'm gonna keep those. So these are gonna go into my bag. Uh, I don't really use the all nighter spray, but I think I'll keep it just in case. I don't know where the cap is. <laughs> um, this is just a case here that I can throw away, throw away garbage. Um, more wrapping. Wrapping. Got two brushes. We'll keep those there. Three brushes. Okay, so a lot of these are actually garbage. I should have made a garbage bag too because these probably are no good anymore. Like even this Tom Ford I've had for like over three or four years. Yeah, it smells a little weird. You can always tell by the smell if it's expired. Usually these will last like six months. Um, to like a year so I'm gonna have to probably give that a toss because it smells like paint it always smells like really like painty I find if it's gone bad this Jeffree Star I've had for a long time too um, Patrick T uh, no this is fine this is pretty new I love these Fenty glosses they're so nice and the lip maximizer this is great for plumping um, we've got a lot of Too Faced right here. This one will keep. What's in here? Oh, wow. Okay. Um, body cream. I have a lot of the Ipsy stuff. I gotta make a little Ipsy. Oh! Anastasia, look at this. I am keeping this. I love that for my brows. Pumpkin mask. Why don't we start like a little Ipsy drawer? That's what I think I'm gonna do. Uh, put that there. Receipts. Uh, I 
spend too much on makeup. Put that in there. Uh, the balm. These are really cute little blushes. I think I'm going to give these away though because I honestly don't wear anything this like shimmery. I feel like one of my friends might want that. So I'll put that in there. We have another brush that I'm keeping. These glosses. Oh, here's the cap. I found the cap. These glosses are some of my favorites. These ones by Too Faced right here. They go with my nails. So I'm going to keep these. The packaging. Oh, packaging on these are so gorgeous. If I had my own line, this is what the lip glosses would look like. I love that. They're so pretty. Um, okay, let's see here. Tom Ford. Just keep that. Milani, these are like... I need to get a bag for garbage because there's a lot of garbage here. Lash smoothie. Okay. Okay, so in here we have just my pink mini brushes. Of course, I'm going to keep those. My goodness, this is a mess. So we've got some these palettes i honestly have so many eyeshadow palettes i might use these for a giveaway uh so let's put them in here for now yeah these would be great for a giveaway maybe in my next video since i want to do like a beauty one as well these are really pretty though haven't even opened them and we have my makeup case here obviously have to clean brushes i also have a little thing for garbage right here not practical Louis Vuitton bag but i don't have time to look for something else or look for something else right now so that's okay um in here so this is all my little oopsie stuff and just like random little minis Okay, I hope you guys can see this. I have another Ipsy bag down here. These I'm gonna go through because I like to get rid of the bigger things and then go through like the little Ipsy things and things like that, um, especially if I'm giving it away. So this right here, we have this little bronzing palette kit that I got from Ipsy. I'm gonna give that away. I'm not gonna keep it. Um, these are beautiful, but I just don't use them. I honestly just use my Tom Ford highlighter and I haven't reached for these in a long time. So I'm gonna also give these away really pretty though actually I might keep one I feel like I would probably use this one if any um, the bronzing one and then this is really pretty but I'm just not using it so I'm gonna give that away too okay so now these here are sent Birds. I remember I, blah, blah, I cannot talk right now. I remember getting sent these a while ago So these are really cool. You can like put other like um, put different fragrances in here and they have so many different ones uh, So I think I'll keep these Now this entire thing I'm sure is expired which is pretty sad But I've had these you guys the Marc Jacobs since the old house I want to say I've had these for like three or four years. So I think it's time for these to go um, Yeah Honestly, you don't want to use expired makeup. I really encourage you to look at the makeup and give it a smell and like just see if it's expired because you could probably get like an infection or, you know, um, there's certain products like eyeshadows and stuff that you can use for a lot longer. But like for lip glosses, they start to smell really weird. Foundations, another thing. Um, oh my gosh, I used this on my wedding day. Look at that. It's all... I've had this for a long time. Why is this not focusing? There we go. It's a beautiful highlighter, but I clearly have had it for a long time. We're going to throw that out. Uh, let's reorganize these. These palettes, I love these little ones here from Too Faced. I'm going to keep all these. They're a little messy, but that's okay. This is just like a little highlighter by Too Faced. Little peach palette. Keep that. Natural. Ooh, that's a nice palette too. I use my palette honestly every day, so I don't really reach for these anymore. Um, oh, that's, yeah, toasty. Let's see here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Chocolate matte. Honestly, I don't really use these. Uh, Milani. I think I'll give this one away. I've had this for so long you guys do you remember this collection this came out like so long ago I think I'm gonna give that away yeah I don't use this either okay. 
haven't even opened this yet. Give it away. Don't use that. Okay, so look at that declutter. I have two little things right here. We're gonna go through, oh, I'll just put this in here for now. Go through this side here, this giving away. Don't use purple, or is this clear or is it purple? Or it's clear ice. Eh, it's okay, I'll get it away. Oops, nail polish. I usually get my nails done, so I think I'm gonna give that away too. I think I got that in my Ipsy bag. Um, through that. What is this? Oh, it's like a bronzing one. Oh, those are nice. I think I'm gonna keep these. I do like these for summer, these colors, so I'm gonna keep that. We got Fenty Beauty powder. I'm gonna keep that. What are these? I wouldn't really wear this shade, so I'm gonna put that away. Um, Maybelline, this isn't even opened. I already have my bronzer by Patrick Ta, so I'm gonna give that away. Oops. Ooh, this is nice. Might keep that, actually. Um, these palettes I'm gonna keep as well. They're just like my gingerbread palettes. This drawer here, I have my makeup cases. And another one, my goodness, these are, don't even know what's in here. I think it's from when I traveled. Okay, so. <laughs> these are the best cases for travel, you guys. You can see everything. Like, I love these cases so much. Um, okay, we have this blush, which I never wear anymore. That in. Okay. I don't really wear this either. I love Christine Dominique's um, Christine Dominique's blushes. These are so nice. I've been using them all the time. Cream blushes. So that's why I'm just not keeping so many because I already have so many of these. Cream blushes. That's garbage. Uh, I'll give this away. It's like a little eyeshadow. These are probably really old. I'm gonna have to chuck those because they have been with me for a long time. What is it? This is opened. <laughs> okay. Okay, we got through one case. There's a pen in here, brush, a little Pat McGrath lipstick. It's like really bright red, blood red. I'm gonna keep that. I don't have a lot of red lipsticks, so. Keep that. Eyeshadow insurance, I'm gonna give this away. I hope my camera's focusing. There we go. Milk away, garbage. This isn't opened. And these are really easy to wipe on the inside. Honestly, you can just use like a baby wipe or a cloth and clean it out. Super easy. Um, I'll put them there for now. What is in here? Okay, so fresh lip balm. I'm gonna keep that. I love that. Is this? Oh, oh, this is a. Soft lip cream. I didn't even know Fresh had a lip cream. Look at that. I'm gonna keep that. Charlotte Tilbury. I love this mascara. I'm gonna keep that. SL Miss Glam. We've got two shadows in here, two matte shades. I'm gonna keep those, obviously. Okay. She got she. Jelly Glaze. Nostalgia. What is this? Lancome, keep that. I think I just got sent that. Um, hydrating mask. And, okay, well, hey, this is dirty. I gotta clean these. I love this lip liner, this Huda Beauty Lip Contour in Honey Beige. I need to buy another one soon. They are awesome. More brush cleaning. Let's keep these in here. Oh, 
probably put my dirty brushes in here for now. drawers here. It's cool. This one. So we've got these Milani blushes. I some of them aren't even open, but I just don't use them. I'm gonna put these all into my giveaway. Really pretty. Just don't need all that makeup. Bronzer. Actually, I'll keep that. Use this steel highlighter. Okay, so downsized there. Now these, I'm gonna keep all these because these are just like liquid eye toppers, which I really enjoy. And this is, or I don't even know what that is. The pixie ones are really amazing. So I'm gonna keep those. I have a little Chanel one. Um, what do we have here? Chanel. I don't know what these are. It's like a face powder, uh, bronzer, little eyeshadow palette. Um, I think I'll keep that. I'll keep that. I don't really use this. We are getting a lot done. I feel really good. I actually watched Kristen Dominique's last video. It was a declutter, and then I was like, I really should do that. And it's the perfect time, December, when you're at home in hibernation, to go through all your makeup. And especially if you like if you shop for a VIB, I know like we're getting so much. Okay, I gotta sit down for this. <laughs> uh, now going through this little container that I have, and also containers. I love the by Algori ones that are on Amazon. I also find ones at my local Home Sense. There's like this big tray I have right here. This is from Home Sense, and then my tray underneath that. That's from Glamlux Shop. Um, so yeah. If you want me to do like another video on just like all my storage options, let me know. Um, we have this, which is the brow. I don't even use this, honestly. So this is going in my giveaway pile right here. I just use the Anastasia Brow Wiz and that's about it. Yeah, two. I don't use this, so I'm gonna throw that in my giveaway. Oh, these were so cute. Clearly I went through them a lot. This Natasha Denona. So, oops, I'm gonna keep these though, because I really like them. Uh, let's put the pixie blushes. I'm gonna give these away. Uh, now these are really cute, these little Too Faced. Um, I think I'm gonna keep the bronze one. Do I like this? Yeah, this is pretty. I like that too. This highlighter. The packaging's like a bit bulky. Like it's kind of big, but we will keep them. And then I have this blush, this instain, which I'm gonna give this away. Get in the pile. So for the stuff on my vanity, I have like my Tom Ford. This is my Energizing Mist. I'm gonna keep that. I have my Soleil Blanc, which I really like that. Um, these are all empty, so I have to throw these out. I don't know why I have so many of them, but I go through them. A lot and this one's full so I'm gonna keep this one here. I have my CEO glow Sunday Riley um, My bronzers, which I'm gonna keep these It's just organizing. I've got this bronzing oil that I got from the ipsy event. I'm gonna put that in here What else do I have? I have this urban decay mini palette. I just got sent this actually from L'Oreal really cute put that in there um, little glow. Oh, yeah, I forgot to show you guys this. This is the brush that I had at the Ipsy uh, New York. Look how pretty it is. Neon, it's so fun. I have a bunch coming to my house, so I'm going to be doing a little giveaway of these. Let me know if you want a set. This is just such a fun, unique color. Um, but yeah, I am going to put all my dirty brushes into a pile. Okay. 
Okay, so before I show you guys the reveal, I have this big thing that I got from Sephora. There's just stuff that I got sent. There's also stuff that I bought. Um, so I'll go through all this after I gotta put my hair care in my little hair care area. Foundation, some peels. I might use some of this for a giveaway. I don't know what this is. Hair oil. My deep cleanse, which I need to get that out. Now, I didn't have time to finish my um, skincare area and hair care area. I have like so much stuff in here filled. So let me know if you'd like to see a declutter of hair care and skincare. I could do that next. And all done. I wanted to show you guys a little reveal before I show you downstairs. I wanted to show you how much I got done yesterday with like wrapping gifts. I got so much done. Uh, so I thought I would quickly show you guys that and then a little reveal of the makeup vanity and then both bags here So this is my giveaway pile. I obviously put way more stuff in here because I was trying to get through it today um, Parts that I didn't film but you can see here like, jam-packed with stuff. I have this palette that I found. I'm also giving away um, Yeah, so that is the giveaway pile now This is the throw out pile because this is all old stuff old foundations. I have that have expired um, so yeah, there's definitely a lot more in the giveaway pile, but um, a lot of stuff that I had to declutter, I feel so good, got through so much. So I'm gonna show you what I did here and then also the like holiday decor that I put up. Um, I'll start over here, I might as well do a little like tour. Uh, we have some Christmas holiday decor. I put this little Christmas tray out with my little eyeshadows, uh, Nutcracker, these are all from HomeSense. A uh, little candle that I have there and then for my makeup vanity I have my Glam Luxe Shop tray Louis Vuitton and then Christine Dominique's uh, blushes I have my palettes on this side with my eyeshadows my brushes my minis back there I have some like skincare products bronzing products foundation all my eyeshadow brushes which are a part of the bundle back there which I think they just like display so nicely like I love these brushes so 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 much um, so we have all those, bronzing oil, uh, some unopened eyeshadows back there. We have a little Christmas tree that I thought I'd put in the middle, Urban Decay palette, and that is basically it. Uh, and on the other side, another nutcracker, and then a picture of me and the fam, an old picture from the old house, if you guys can see that. And then also a little Christmas tree and some fragrances, the Chloe one that Ryan got me. We have a little candle right there, Christmas tree and my fragrances. So yeah, that is on my little tray that I have from HomeSense there. Um, I got that from my friend Kat. I think that's where she got it from. But um, yeah, that is my makeup declutter. I feel so good. I got so much done. Oh, and to show you the inside of the drawers really quickly right here at my brush cleaners. These are double stackable, by the way. Um, these ones here that I got off Amazon. Uh, we have majorly, majorly decluttered the lip glosses. In here, it's like basically empty. We have my Too Faced stuff. Um, I have my makeup bag in here with my Ipsy stuff. Uh, palettes, downsized, really downsized over there. Uh, over here, we have really downsized as well. There's like half the drawer missing there. Right here. Right here, I put some of the new stuff I got from Ipsy just in there. All of these. And yeah, that's basically it. Nothing's in there. So, I think I did a pretty good job and I filmed this today, got this video up today. I feel really good. And like I said, I'm getting more videos up. Um, but yeah, let's head downstairs and I'll quickly show you guys all my wrapping in the tree. Okay, so a lot more ornaments on the tree, as you guys can see. We went to Canadian Tire yesterday. I got a ton more. Um, so we've got, I tried to like just hide all the presents. They've been pretty good because I've said a lot of them are for uh, their friends. So they're like, this is for Hugo or this is for Michael and they don't open it. Um, so it's been pretty good. Uh, Mia definitely has her eyes on a lot of the presents, but I got these really cute little name tags as well um, yesterday, which are really cute. Uh, right here, I got these cute little bags in like a little set that I got from Canadian Tire and a lot of new ornaments. So I'm really, really excited about the tree. Sophia helped me pick out the puppy yesterday. Um, where's the, oh, the ice skates you guys already saw. I got these big bows. Um, what 
else is new? I'm trying to. Oh yeah, these I got these really nice snowflakes. We have birdies. Um, this was from the trip in Florida. This is also new. We got the little doggy yesterday and got Mr. Penguin. There's so many. And then I put these on the tree, which I think just filled them a little bit more. And then also I got the little wreath. And then the other thing that I did, I know it's not dark so you can't see, um, but uh, I fluffed snow. And this is what I mean. If you just buy like bags of this, this is just like fake snow um, it, to fill the tree. It's a great idea because this tree didn't come like pre, um, like, you know how they have like the fake snow on the trees, which my last, last year one already had that, but I gave it to my friend. Um, but yeah, that was really helpful that it came like pre-fluffed and like there was fake snow on it. So I had to create my own just to fill the tree, but I think it looks a lot better. I just have to do the top after when I have some time and a ladder, <laughs> but I got this part done and I also got, I'm still wrapping, sorry about the mess. Um, right here, this Santa Claus I got. Sophia helped me pick it out and Mia was with Ryan yesterday, um, but I picked up this Santa and they love Santa and the little elves. Got this for one of their little friends. I have to wrap that after. And yesterday I spent like four hours wrapping presents, you guys. It was just crazy. Um, the girls clearly have gotten through some stuff, but that's okay. Uh, we also have presents over here. Uh, little bags that I got. There's tons more back there. Just trying to like hide everything, but they've been pretty good. Uh, right here, and I have friends coming over this Sunday for a little gift exchange and skating day, so that'll be fun. Oops. And basically for these, I just put from Santa, and then there's some from Ryan, and then some from me. These were the uh, little sticker books that I bought. They're so cute for the name tags. I went through so many of them yesterday. Um, so yeah just really fun for Christmas and then I also have just a few more Christmas bags that we're gonna use for friends. Just wanted to end this uh, video in the office so of course congratulations to our winner Stephanie again of all these goodies um, you know all my product line and then also we have some glow recipe so I'm gonna be shipping this out and then uh, yeah the new giveaway also I'm sorry I haven't cleaned my office yet obviously because I got sick and I yeah have not had time um but definitely enter today's giveaway the $400 cash prize giveaway I'm going to be announcing the winner in the next video like I said if you get comments or you know like you're the winner they're not real those are fake um so don't you know fall for that uh so yeah all you guys have to do leave a comment down below what you like most about my channel give this video a thumbs up be subscribed that's how you enter super easy and i hope you guys have an amazing day we are about to go skating i'm gonna get the girls ready here in a minute um so that hopefully will be in my next vlog i will see you guys in my next video